the biggest problem was clear in front of their faces in 1907 when the financial system failed. The central dilemma the Fed had was that it had two incompatible goals. I have one lesson indelible in my brain. Don't let inflation get ingrained. Once that happens, there's too much agony in stopping the momentum. I think we did the right thing in 87. I think we did the right thing in 2007 and 2008. You just pour liquidity into the system. That was indeed a fateful day. Um, and in some ways, uh, I think it ushered in the modern era of Federal Reserve uh, crisis management. What I thought was problematic before the global financial crisis was the sense that the smartest people in the universe were in Goldman Sachs and in Morgan Stanley. And if they were so smart, how could they get into trouble? There was not one shock, but there was a series of shock. We had the pandemic, we had a positive fiscal policy shock, and then we had the war. If I were to point to one thing as, as a culprit for, for the Fed making the inflation forecast mistake, I would think uh, it would be mainly institutional groupthink. MMT approach that you describe, uh, if, if the Fed is no longer independent, then it falls on the fiscal authorities to control inflation. 